Hey everyone, it's Graphic back with another video, and today we're going to be talking a little bit about what you should be holding on to in New World. This is a set that a lot of you guys have not been holding on to, and that's why it's no value or you really can't find it on the trading post. Nobody's selling it because nobody's buying it, right? So this is a piece of gear or pieces of gear that you need to be holding on to, like I said, coming in the next months with Starstone and Amrine Expeditions, you can see that Ancient and Lost Gear have gone up a ton. If you look and try to find stuff that, like I have here, is Strength, Enfeebling Maelstrom, Ancient Ward, or if you go to my boots here, it has Refreshing Torrent, Ancient Ward, and Strength. You're not going to find these on the market. You're just not. So it's going to be very, very hard to find them. If you do find them, you know, you're going to pay that, you know, very, very hefty price. So what could you be doing right now in advance? Well, we're going to ignore the next expedition. We're not going to focus in on the ancient lost sets that a lot of people are going to be buying up. Instead, today, we're going to focus on Beast Ward gear. This is for the Sandworm raid boss coming, and a lot of people have already seen the Sandworm in many different reaction videos or even in your for yourself. If you've actually gone up to Brimstone, you can actually see, you know, Brimstone is a big place, and the Sandworm does appear. I believe it's right here on the map. Uh, but I, I've seen it, I believe, in a couple different places. But I, I know for sure it's around there. But it's just crazy to see this huge worm, right? You can't kill it. You can just look at it. Well, they are bringing it to a raid boss uh, category. So we're going to be actually able to fight this thing with 10 to 15 to 20 other players. We don't know exactly how many yet. But because of this, what you should be doing is kind of obvious. And I think a lot of people just don't think about these things. And I want to make sure you guys start to. So you can see here, if I type in Beast Ward, you can get Beast Ward stuff very, very cheaply on the market right now, as people just are not willing to pay for it because it's, you know, a couple months out. Well, this is going to save you a ton of money in the long run. As you can see here, you can get Blight Resistance, Beast Ward, and Freedom. You can also go for stuff that are just, you know, legendary with that Beast Ward, and it's going to be very, very cheap prices right now. There's not too much on the market because people are just salvaging it right away. So that's another reason I wanted to kind of mention this today is... People are salvaging Beast Ward gear instantly. If you guys are getting Beast Ward gear or Beast, uh, or Beast, what is it, Beast Bane? There we go. If you guys get Beast Bane weapons as well, definitely hold on to it as it's going to be very, very valuable as well as you'll need some for these raids coming up. I think they're going to be a ton of, ton of reasons to do these raids as they're going to have probably the best gear in the game at that point and a lot of people are going to be wanting to run those. So Beast Ward gear and beast bane ward gear are going to be very very important for all of us to hang on to and make sure we have at the release of the sandworm raid that's just one thing i wanted to kind of mention today so it was a quick video but i will say as well if you aren't following me on twitch make sure to do so we are starting to stream on thursdays saturdays and mondays coming up in the next couple of weeks so expect me live on saturday Thursday, Monday, 2 p.m. Eastern. You can see here. Follow me, twitch.tv slash iGraph. It's going to be in the comment section or actually the description of the video. And then as well, if you haven't already, make sure to like the video, subscribe to the channel, and turn notifications on. Hopefully you guys, like I said, have some good luck with Beast Ward gear and Beast Corrupted, or not Beast Corrupted, but Beast Bane gear as well, because it's going to sell for a pretty penny when that raid boss is getting closer and closer to release. Thank you guys so much for tuning in. I'll see you all in the next one.